2016-17 British Mathematical Olympiad United Kingdom Mathematics Trust. Problem number three, round one, UKMT. But it is for BMO, the exam. The logo is for UKMT. Determine all partners M and N of positive integers which satisfy the equation N squared minus 6N equal to M squared plus M minus 10. Okay, I take N and M to left hand side. So let's write the equation N squared minus 6N equal to M squared plus M minus 10. I take this negative 10 to left hand side and these two things to right hand side. Then it will be 10 equal to M squared plus M minus N squared minus 6N. Now, I want to factorize change to square. I should use what? I know X plus Y squared equal to, you should know these two identities. We're solving the problem x squared plus 2xy plus y squared and x minus y squared equal to x squared minus 2xy plus y squared. Now, if I use this here, m squared plus m, I say I can use m squared. Let me tell you, you should say m plus one half squared. If you raise it to the power of 2, it will be m squared plus m plus 1 over 4. So you should subtract by 1 over 4. Now it is exactly equal to this by using this identity. Now for next one, minus. For this one, you say n minus 3 squared. Then you have n squared minus 6n. But you have plus 9. So you should subtract by 9. I've used this identity equal to 10. Okay, I have this now. I add both sides by 1 over 4 and negative 1, negative 9, minus 9. So I have 10 plus 1 over 4, minus 9, equal to m plus 1 over 2 squared minus n minus 3 squared. Okay, so if we simplify, 10 minus 9 is 1. 1 plus 1 over 4 is 5 over 4. So I write 5 over 4 equal to this part. m plus 1 over 2 squared. m plus 1 over 2 squared minus n minus 3 squared. Now, if we multiply both sides by 4, the left-hand side will be 5. The right-hand side will be 2. And because when 4... Those inside the square, it will be 2. So it will be 2m plus 2 times 1 half is 1 squared minus 2n minus 6 squared. Okay, now we have a famous identity that if we have a squared minus b squared, it will be a minus b times a plus b. Now, if I use this identity, then I can say 5 equal to 2m plus 1 minus 2n minus 6 times 2m plus 1 plus 2n minus 6. Now, we conclude 5 equal to 2m minus 2n, 1 minus minus 6 plus 6 plus 7. 2m, the next one, plus 2n, 1 minus 6 is minus 5. So, we have two parts, and the product is 5. So the cases are 1, 5, I, 1, negative 1, negative 5, and negative 5, negative 1. So we have, if I want to write smaller, let me write with other color. 1, 5, 5, 1, negative 1, negative 5 negative 5, negative 1. So let's work on this on next page. Okay, we have four cases. Let's consider the first one as first case. 2m minus 2n plus 7 equal to 1. We saw I explained one of them completely. Then we can solve the rest easily, like equal to 5. So if you add these two things, 
it will be 2n plus 2n, 4n. Negative 2n, 2n will be cancelled. 7 minus 5 will be 2. So some of them will be 4n plus 2. So I can write some of them. 4n plus 2. For first one, it will be 6. For next one, 6. For next one, negative 6, negative 6. So 4n plus 2 here will be 6. Now, it is adding, let's subtract. They call this one first one, second one. I say 2 minus 1. So 2m minus 2m will be canceled. 2n minus minus 2n will be 4n. Negative 5, negative 7 will be negative 12 equal to 5 minus 1, 4. So here, 4n minus 12, second term minus first term. We 5 minus 1, 4. This one, 1 minus 5, negative 4. Next one, negative 5, negative, negative 1, negative 4. Negative 1, negative, negative 5, which will be negative 1 plus 5 which will be 4. Okay, so because 4m plus 2, 4m minus 12 is this, we can conclude. 4m is what? You should subtract by 2. It will be 4. Next one will be also 4. Next one, subtract by 2. Negative 8, negative 8. Now this one, 4m. You should add by 12. 12 plus 4, 16. 12 minus 4, 8. 12 minus 4, 8. 12 plus 4. 16. Now we divide m and n by 4. So if I write with other colors, let me erase here. Okay, so m and n. We should divide by 4. It will be 1, 4, 1, u. The next one, negative 2, and 2. And the last one, negative 2 and 4. Because the problem says M and N are positive integers. So we say this answer, this answer are wrong, this one and this one are correct. So we should check M and N 1, 4, 1, 2. So let's check 1, 4, 1, 2 in this equation. Okay, 1, 4, let's check it first. 1, 4, and 1, and C, and 4. So it will be 4 to squared left hand side minus 6 times 4. Is it equal to m is 1? 1 is squared plus 1 minus 10. So it is 16 minus 24. Is it equal to 1 plus 1, 2 minus 10? It is 8, negative 8. 2 minus 10 is negative 8. And also it is negative 8. And we will see this correct. The next one. So one answer is this. 4 and 1 and 4. The other one, the problem says find M and N, right? Yes. So 1, 4 is one answer. Let's check the next one. 1 and 2. M, 1 and 2. N squared minus 6 and 2 squared minus 6 times 2 equal to M squared 1 squared plus 1 minus 10. Yeah, it will be negative 8 and this part will be 4 minus 12 which will be negative 8 again. So 1 and 2 work. So M and N are these two answers. Okay, positive integers. Let me write another problem for you as homework. Try again. M and N here are integers. And solve this. N squared minus 8N equal to M squared plus 3N minus 12. Try to solve this problem. And you can comment your answers right below this video. If you want to learn other important ideas, you can send message to my number, WhatsApp number in the description and also comments. And please don't forget to subscribe, turn on notification, and like the video. Thanks. Bye-bye.